Oh, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Storage Hustle Simulator where today we're going to pick things back up here and um, I think we're going to check out some uh, some of the uh, auctions at the uh, storage units because um, last episode we went and did a bunch of rummage sales. We hit like five or six of them I think and um, we made a little bit of money but it wasn't really all that great so I think we're going to head back to the um, storage units try to hit some of those. I think uh, we we definitely made... Oops. Actually, it was probably better. We, otherwise, we would have hit that guy. But <laughs> um, I think, uh, well, not I think. I know we definitely made a lot more money doing the uh, storage units, buying and flipping all stuff in those um, than we did with the uh, rummage sales. So I think this is going to be the way to go for now. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll just do like one big one. I don't know. I kind of like uh, some of the small ones, or especially with the money we have. But I think um, we'll just... Uh, um... That's honestly not all that. I don't even know if I want that, honestly. We got Melon Husk. <laughs> we got OnlyFans. We got a Karen. It's all good, man. Um, there's a quick buy. I didn't even notice that. Oh, yeah. This one's pretty expensive. I don't think this one's worth it, honestly. I think I'm just going to let this one go. Yeah, it just closes that out. I think, yeah, I don't think that one was all that worth it, especially for the money that it was going going for. Um, we've got, it's like we got a couple at 6 o'clock, got a couple at 1400 which we're a couple minutes away from that. I don't know. Like I said, I don't think that was all that worth it for those. Let's see, what do we have going on? Why don't we go check out one of these houses for, for sale real quick? I want to see what uh, one of those look like while we're waiting. We've got a couple minutes to spare. Until the uh, auction starts, which this was, yeah, right straight across. I almost hit escape again on that, Trenton. I just would have ended up pausing the game. But I just want to see, wait, was it this one? No, next one. Okay. Yeah, I just want to see what uh, one of these houses look like that are for sale. And how much they are. It looks like 25000 Yeah, 25000 Which We don't have enough money for that. Actually, a cute little house. I'm just gonna come looking at. I'm just gonna come, come up and stare in your windows. I know it's not even mine, but just want to see inside. I, I, I'm kind of curious to see like what um, we can get out of having a house. If there's any benefit to it, like obviously we have a garage and stuff here, or what we can do with like our house that we have now, if we could actually like sell it, or I don't, even, I don't know. I'm not sure. We'll have to definitely check that out in uh, future episodes, but that's gonna be a little bit since. A little bit pricey, and we got other upgrades and everything else to do. So let's head on back to the uh, auction, where that's going to start here in about a minute or so. It'll be perfect timing to get back. Yeah, it'd be kind of nice to be a little more centralized as well, which actually something like that would be really pretty centralized versus us being all the way down here. We kind of have to drive up everything. And, ooh, there's actually a rummage sale right by our property, which we get a couple others. I mean, the map is that big so it only takes a little bit to get to everything but um be a little be a little nicer to be a little more centralized okay well, i'm glad like when we like select to like start it and check out what's inside we don't have to actually like, buy into it like a car for sale sim you have to buy like an auction ticket just to uh, purchase something but i guess those you can see the vehicles too before you actually purchase anything okay so we've got about 20 seconds or so and then um we will be getting right into it here. Like I said, I kind of want to purchase. I usually like to purchase two of them. It seems like it seems like that's the best best way to go about it. But um, if we only can do one, and we don't have a ton of money, that's the way we'll go then. But yeah, I definitely. Yeah, I think I I think I started off last episode with like just over five hundred dollars because I was saying I could do the um, repair tool upgrade, which is five hundred, and then but I wouldn't have any money left then. So we've got um, one hundred two and. Let's see here. Let's just take a look at what's in here. Okay, there's... Oh, there's a drone here. There's a couple boxes, too. I think this one I'll purchase if we can. So we got OnlyFams. We got Jennifer. We got Daddy Issues. We got Marvin. I'll get in on this, some of this action. We got Daddy Issues going in. I won't let you have the storage. Well, I won't let you have it. As long as it's under $540. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just going to keep bidding $10 only because I don't want to drive up the price anymore. Even though I know it may take a little bit longer, but I want to try to get it for as cheap as possible. 
It's like, yeah, we got that. Okay. So we got $168 left. We got some of our items here. I'm guessing... Let's just take a look here if we can get this. Ooh, that... There's like one item in there. because that, That's just trash, I'm guessing. So I don't think I want this. I guess we'll we'll try to bid, see if we can get it for, for pretty cheap here. I know you can get uh, screwed over sometimes on auctions as well, and uh, actually lose out of money. Um, let's try one more. Let's just if we can get it for 160 bucks, we'll go for it. But if not, obviously I can't afford it anymore. And looks like we're gonna get it. Okay, I don't know if that was the wisest decision, but we went for it. Sometimes you just got to jump in head first on things in life. Oh, we got a couple other items actually here. Okay. So we got, um, let's see here. How much is this worth? Got about $50. We can probably sell that for 60. Oh, we got 90. Okay. Ooh, okay. We got, we actually got some decent stuff here. Got twenty eight dollars. We got a broken hat. We got a broken clock. Okay. Yeah. I, honestly, I don't think that was that bad. Can I actually uh, just grab this whole box? No. Okay. Let me grab my truck. I'm gonna pull it a little closer. Yeah, I think that was well worth it. I know we're about out of money here, but we're obviously gonna make quite a bit back on that. We already know that these uh, boxes are worth um, nothing, so we're not gonna worry about grabbing that. We found that in the first episode. Let's uh, grab all this stuff. Grab that. Yeah, I think this was a... I mean, there's not like a ton of big stuff in here, but there's some decent little small stuff. We're able to make some money. It's It'll be, it'll be worth it. Just got to get it all listed and just take a little bit of time, but that's what this is all about. Okay. Let's check out... Um, may as well scan everything that we can here. Got a nice deck chair, $30. 50 for that. We got a broke. Oh, it's broken. Okay, well, I mean, we should be able to repair it, but. Got a broken mask here. Got a watermelon. <laughs> we can scan that. Um, I think we're going to have to open up these boxes, recycle this stuff. Open up that. Ooh, we got, we got an old, cam old Polaroid camera here. Haven't seen one of those yet. Got $64 on that. Honestly, I don't know. I mean, I think we'll come out okay on this, but we might have actually got a boomer phone. <laughs> we got 100% real fake gold. <laughs> that's funny. Okay, we got a hacksaw here. That That's that's nice. Got a, looks like a tuna can. Nope, we accidentally grabbed that. Didn't mean to do that, but that's all right. Grab the camera out of here. Because you also get money for recycling, too. So, I mean, I guess... Well, not much, but we got two bucks out of that. We got an old book here. I don't know. I don't think this was an amazing haul, but I think we're going to come out on top with it. I'm actually curious to see how much we end up with um, compared to what we started with. We started with about 560-ish or so. I'm definitely going to try to repair what we can on all this. But yeah, I think um, I was definitely thinking that drone was going to be more, more valuable. But we'll see what it is once we repair it, because I don't see why we, we wouldn't be able to repair that. It's so small, I can't tell if it's actually there or not. Yeah. Not even going to say it. <laughs> okay. I think we've got everything. Oops. Did not mean to pick that up. Make sure we're not leaving anything behind. Oh, we are leaving something behind. It's like our flashlight here. We want that. I mean, every every little bit helps. We don't want to leave anything behind. Okay. Let's head on back home. Get this stuff listed for sale. Or I, I guess I should say start by repairing what we can. Then we'll uh, get this stuff listed for sale. Yeah, we got to cut all the way across here. It's going to be, yeah, this guy. 
I just gotta remember to start just going down to the dealership and then take a left there at the dealership and then go straight across and then do the same thing coming back. I don't know if I want to pull everything out of the truck. I guess I can see what's actually broken on the uh, computer as well while I'm listing stuff, so I don't really need to um, need to pull everything out. Honestly, well, I might just throw everything out. Got a normal basketball. Is that going to try to roll away on me? No? Okay. Okay, so this drone is broken. We're going to want to repair that. That's good. Got this broken face mask. It's going to put everything off to the side that actually needs to be repaired. So we can repair it, get, everything, get as much money for everything as we can. Throw that there. I know we have shelving that we could be using, but that's all right. Got a good Polaroid camera here. It's getting a little hard to see. Now with it getting a little bit later. Must have been some, some uh, sporty people or a sporty family that had the storage unit. There's a lot of um, sports stuff. I know we can open up the um, tailgate here as well. Looks like that's going to be everything. So we got all everything that we need to fix here. Let's repair it. I also don't know if we get, with the uh, better upgrade, if we can actually repair it to a better status as well. Like, because right now we're just repairing it to bad. It looks like I think we can. So that's, I think, something we're, we're going to want to check out here too. Especially being only $500, I think that'd be a better upgrade, or good upgrade to do here. Which, um, that's probably something we'll do next here then. We got a normal basketball, we're going to be at $22.75, so let's go $30. Yeah, we'll go $35 on that. 100% fake gold. 100% real fake gold. <laughs> um... We'll go 70 on this, just just because. Um, we'll go 70 on this also. We gotta start raising our prices on stuff. I think if we're not almost doubling our money for each item. Yes, I can. Yes, we can. I'm gonna just... I wanna have it. See, we're... They're, we're getting less money for stuff than what. But I can't, uh, I can either. Yeah, that's what's going on with this. Do we have any other skill points? That I can see. Yeah, I've got five. Holy crap, I didn't realize. So let's do that. Do I need to, um. Do I need to have this? Yeah, I do. Let's see the patience of people. Okay. Gain more XP from selling items. That's actually really good. Okay. Cause yeah, we're getting we're getting screwed over here. I'm not getting full value of what I'm actually listing stuff for. And it doesn't say my my price even. And I can't even... Okay, I'm going to go to sleep here real quick. Grandma's nightclub debt. <laughs> okay, what was Granny doing in the club? And why was it only $15? Okay. Yeah, we need to make some money back here because we are getting really screwed on stuff. Yeah, I was trying to uh, reset it by... Just going out of it, but that did not work. Okay, Anvil, we got seventy-two dollars. Let's go one forty. Twenty-eight. Let's go fifty. Let's go one twenty. Let's go one eighty. I'm just gonna set them to basically about double. And if we get traffic on it, great. If not, then we'll drop the price. Let's go 15. Let's go 40. Yeah, we're getting a lot of traffic here. Let's go, let's go 100 on this. Okay, let's start at the top. 116. 125, and you have a deal. 
122. All right, I can do that. 44. Let's go 47. We'll meet in the middle. At that 46, got a deal. Can you give 100? Okay, let's go 110. We'll meet in the middle. 105, we'll meet in the middle. All right. All right, now we're starting to make some money here. Let's go one, 165. On that 162, we got a deal. 54, I like it. Let's go 57, meet in the middle, and then, yep, you're going to offer me 56. You got a deal. All right, now we're starting to make some money. Straight up cool. All right, 34. Let's go 37. And you're going to offer me 36. Yep, you got a deal. Yeah, that these are definitely the way to go. I've, I see that now. Put it on sale for 90. Got 20 for this. Got a mask. We've got 37 on that, so let's go 70. 15. 28. Let's go. Yeah, we'll go 50. We got a bad football for 20. Or I'm sorry, soccer. Yeah, it says foot. That's why. That's why I said football. It says. I guess. Um, if you're talking like European. Um. Yeah. See, I just got 36 dollars for that only, and I had it for listed for 90, but it doesn't. I can't tell if it's just a bug or what's going on with that. But then I just got $36 for that. So I think something is bugged with this. So 44, we got 50, so let's go 47. You're going to offer me 46. Yep, I will take that. I want it. Deal still on. you have got 46 for that. I, I don't understand that. 25. Yeah, I probably should have gone 20 on that. Because we're sitting on this drone here as well. Let's go 80 on this. Let's go 20 on this. Okay. I think, um, actually, you know what? I'm going to take this off sale. I am going to use some of this to upgrade my two repair tool for 500. Now we got some cash. Let me see what I can uh, do with this now. Yeah, we can repair this. We can do, okay, normal. Which there is more that we could do to this if we had a better upgraded tool, even more than that. So we should be able to get even more money for this now. So now if we do, say, 120, let's do that. I'll give you 20. That's what I have it listed for. Okay. <laughs> he's like offering me like trying to haggle, but he's offering me my, my asking price on that. Okay, well, I'm glad we got the upgraded tool now. Let's see if we can get this sold here for 120. If not, I'll drop the price down a little bit, probably back down to 100. And um, we'll have made about $500 today then, which is much better than what uh, we did on the uh, yard sales. Okay, we're not getting any traffic on it. Let's go 100. I think we should get uh, some traffic from that now. Yeah, that was a good, um, a good full day's worth of work for that. Ah, the sun is shining. People are outside walking. We got a new customer here. Let's go. Your shop. Give stuff, take. See, we only got $20 for that, but yet, I... I don't know. I don't understand that. I don't know, like I said, if that's a bug or what. I'm guessing there's going to be probably uh, future updates to this game. Maybe that's just a bug and it'll get fixed here. So if anybody um, seems to catch this for whatever reason, if the devs see this at all, I doubt they will. Um, but if they do at all, keep um, either let me know in the comments or uh, take a look and see if that is a bug with the game because it was really annoying. Like I just had to list it for 100 bucks and I got $20 out of that. So I don't understand. And it all I can't do any other offers. It's either accept it or reject it. And it doesn't even tell me what they're actually offering. If they are just doing like an offer, try to haggle. So, I don't know. But um, if you guys enjoyed, uh, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. It's greatly appreciated. And, um, yeah, we'll catch you guys all next time. Peace out.